From the venue for the Europa League final, St. Jakob Park in Basel, Switzerland. And here we have Real Betis against Osasuna. This is Peter Drury, and next to me, providing insights, will be Jim Beglin. Well, I can tell you, I'm truly delighted to join you, Peter, and, and thank you very much for that. on the way William Carvalho Christian Teo William Carvalho Mondi Bartra it's a long forward pass now it's Adrian looks to slip it through and that's surely a foul free kick Out to safety. Garcia plays it into the channel. Carlos Elena. Christian Teo. Joaquin. Well, each team knows that they're still well below standard, and it's a question of uh, which can uh, find a way out. Bartra with a long pass out wide. Dinks one in. Cuts it out. Carlos Elena. Osasuna seem happy to let their strikers roam out wide. I wouldn't want that. No? Yeah, well, my worry is that their, their main threat is being shifted out of contention. He's made sure that that won't get through. Mondi. Bartra. Carlos Elena. Bartra plays it out to the wing. Canales gets it back. Garcia long and high towards the flank Real Betis have a poor touch to thank for getting away with it look sometimes you're already thinking about what you're going to do next and you suffer a little lapse in concentration and end up with a, a red face moment like that it's very frustrating Carlos Elena Still, rather frustratingly, it is nil-nil. Christian Teo. Mondi. Christian Teo. Christian Teo. And that's been repelled. Torres. He's gone long. The half-time whistle goes. Reflections on the first half. Well, the manager surely got to look for one or two creative changes now. They need some service up front. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil-nil. Nil-nil then, and we're back on the way. That's the throw. Canales. 
looking crossfield, changing the point of attack. Promising move that, good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Who's going to make this theirs? It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Well, he's the quarterback equivalent, so I'm not surprised that he's being closed down first. Forward it goes. It's come loose. Joaquin pumps it upfield. William Carvalho. Canales is fouled. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Clearance and very necessary. Spoon forward. Teo deftly done. Big chance! Vila tries to get it forward quickly. Gets himself into trouble and he's lost it. And he certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. The outcome could so easily have been different. Torres would have known he needed to generate more power behind that, but it just lacked the precision anyway. Mondi. Plays a clever pass. Canales. Tries to stroke it through. And the defence can get it clear. Away from immediate danger. Canales looks to dink one in. Clears it out of harm's way. Here comes another cross. here well, what we're witnessing now just goes against the grain they're not going to get back into the game like this out to the left it goes Vila and that will be the final act well it looked nil-nil from a fair way out little craft or guile or penetration